over Cheesecake Factory have a brunch on Saturday. So that's where I'm we're on the way to. Look at my man looking all sexy over there, whatever. His in his his sway, in his 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 velour. You know I got my animal print on. Just looking good out here. It's a pretty day. So we're gonna take y'all along with us while we enjoy our Sunday fun day. y'all i think i'm gonna get me a lemon drop or something or a um what's that drink called i like that mimosa yeah mimosa. So, we're just trying to figure out what we're gonna eat and i always love coming in here because i think it's so pretty we at the cheesecake factory they didn't have my lemonade so i have to get sweet tea yeah you love sweet tea what you got? I got me mimosa. You know how I have to get my little drink mm -hmm. on. I think I want to get a martini after this. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, we're just vibing, chilling. All right, then we back. Got the uh, cinnamon roll pancakes, mm -hmm. some eggs, potatoes. I got the brulee French toast. And I think they gave me a McMuffin. And I had spinach in my eggs, but they forgot to put them in there. So, like, she's going to bring me some new eggs. And I got the Excited, I love Lush. Like, there's nothing like a bowl bath with a Lush. I'm going Just 
You can keep looking at folks every time you come in here. I think you like them. I want to be real body like right? It's a soft. They got teams in here? Over here, Mom. We are at Ulta Beauty. And I love to be here because they have so many different bath products and perfumes and makeup. So it's like Wonderland for me. So I'm just looking at their perfumes. I do want some new perfumes. So y'all, we have left the mall. I did a little damage. I got me a fragrance. I'm gonna show y'all what I got later. And I also got me some stuff from Lush. I'm gonna also show y'all. <clears throat> so we really need to go grocery shopping because if we don't do it on Saturday, we like to do it on Sunday. And we need to start back doing it on Fridays like we used to. But Tell me what today is. Today is our anniversary, and it's for nine months. We've been together nine months and it seems so much longer than that. People always say they seem, it seems like we've been together longer, but it has actually only been nine months. But yeah, what I was saying was this is our nine month anniversary. So we didn't even realize it until we were in the mall and somebody said something and we were like, hold up. So this is a cool little outing for our anniversary just to hang out. And y'all, it's hot outside. I got on leather pants and a cardigan and it is burning up like people out here got on shorts you know, like, oh, no. to get into trader joe's i really want to go to trader joe's because where we live um there's no trader joe's so but i refuse to wait this long to get into trader joe's so not today also got out of those clothes I had on like I told y'all it was really hot today and I had on like leather pants a cardigan my outfit was cute now but I was really hot so when I came home I came and got in my robe my bag actually got this for me like a few months ago from Victoria's Secret but yeah so I went to Ulta and Lush from Ulta, the first thing I got is this Marc Jacobs fragrance. Y'all, it smells so good. The girl that um, was working there, the associate that was helping me to smell the perfumes, um, she was like, this is her favorite. And I was like, okay, I gotta try it. And we smelled some other ones, but this happened to be the, the best one I could find. It's really like a fresh scent. One second, let me get the box open what it looks like it's the mark jacobs daisy perfume and i actually got ended up getting the gift set um the holiday gift set because i just like i got more bang for my buck um also the original is like i think the the, the bottle that is actually smaller than this one um which is the biggest normal size is about a hundred dollars and the bottle is not as cute doesn't have the flowers on it so i really thought that was cute because it'll be really cute on my vanity and then I got a it comes with the travel size perfume that you can put in your purse so that's always great and then it came with uh, a lotion as well body lotion um so yeah it just it smells so good the, I don't even know how to describe it it's almost like a fresh scent but it still is very feminine very soft um I'm uh ready to see how it wears to see like how long it lasts um but yeah that's the first thing I got it's actually this Kylie Jenner um it says press powder palette uh, it's an eyeshadow palette um and typically this is not something that I would have bought and I actually did not buy it um when I got the scent sorry guys one second when I got the scent um it came I guess as a gift so I love when you buy things from the stores and they gift you with things as well for purchases so i thought i could get more bang for my buck 
Um, oh yeah, and if you're wondering, the Daisy Perfume gift set was like $120, I believe, um, in total, which I feel like is not too bad for the size of the perfume you get, plus the lotion, plus the travel spray. But this is the Kylie Jenner palette that I got, and it comes with a mirror. Hey, girl. And these are some of the shades. So, I feel like this is really wearable. I, I need to get it by some light. It's pretty dim in my house right now. But, um, it's kind of like a neutrals palette, I feel. Like, there's some pretty neutral shades in there. The orange is really pretty. Um, you always can't go wrong with the black, gold. So, I think I will have fun doing a, like, maybe my first makeup tutorial with this. We'll see. But yeah, that's the second thing. Um, and then lastly, this is gonna be kind of a surprise for me, which is also was a gift um set. Um, but it came as a gift as well um from Ulta. It's a little dirty. <clears throat> but uh they told me that it was three candles in here, and I have not smelled them or anything, so this is gonna be like <clears throat> a first. So open it up. Ooh. So from first look, let's see, looks like there's a white one. Um, this one is black packaging, and then this one is marble. Ooh, really pretty. And I've been needing some candles, and I've been make, meaning to make my way to Bath & Body Works to get me some new, like, fall, winter scented candles, but I just haven't made my way. So this was right on time. Um, so this one's called Glow. Let me smell this one and see what it smells like. So... The scent smells kind of subtle. It doesn't tell me what notes are on it. Maybe it's at the bottom of the box. But it kind of sounds vanilla-ish to me. And I love anything vanilla. If you know me, you know that. So I think that would be nice. The second one is called Spi Sparkle and Spice. No, ooh, I'm wrong. The first one was called Vanilla Glow. So my nose did find it right. It's vanilla. This one's called Sparkle and Spice. Oh, that's a very nice then fall. Kind of smells like an apple spice cinnamon type of scent. Like if you ever have had those type of scents in your home or in your fragrances or whatever, you know what I'm talking about. The classic scent, like the spice. Smells really good. <clears throat> and then the third one, which is the marble packaging, says Winter Forest Glam. Hmm. It's kind of woodsy. It smells like something familiar that I've had, like maybe in a <clears throat> in a uh, air freshener or something like that. But I think these are really some classic home scents. So I'm probably just going to place these around my house and burn them when I please. My second store that I went to was Lush. Um, well, actually, it was the first store I went to. And it was really interesting because if the last few times I've been there because of COVID, you haven't been able to go in and really experience the Lush experience. If you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. Um, but uh this time was different you actually were able to go in and shop but they only did like one party at a time so if you and like a few of your friends or family members were together y'all could go in together but you had to wait until the party in front of you came out so we were good because when we got in line it was only like another one party in front of us and one party in the store so uh it didn't take we probably stood in line for like less than 15 minutes and then we got to go in um, so I was excited about that because I hadn't been in a lush, just being able to roam around and smell and touch the fragrances or the bath bombs or whatever since the beginning of the year. So that was fun. So I'm going to show you what I got from Lush. So the first thing I got, well, I actually got four bath bombs. So um, if you're anything like me, you cannot go to Lush and not get at least one bath bomb. And if, I, if you go, you really should get more than one because if you get one, you're going to want another one. And I think they're just the perfect item to have for like a self-care night or self-care morning just to pamper yourself to get in the bathtub and just enjoy yourself if you are a person that loves to take baths or if you're trying to get into taking baths um you will love lush bath bombs now they are a little more on the pricier side but i feel like they're worth it um i don't like the generic bath bombs that walmart target sale i feel like they're not 
um, good for your skin. They're usually made with cheap products. Lush, if you know Lush, you know they make all their products with natural ingredients. So if you're somebody like me who has sensitive skin, then that is something that you will enjoy. So Lush, that's bae. I love Lush. So the first mask bomb I got, and I don't remember the names of these. I might be able to find my receipt and link them down below. Um, but the first one I got is this little gift box. And it's got like a cute little bow on it and it's gold. It doesn't have glitter on it, but it is a little shiny. Um, but it's so cute. And oh God, I almost, oh, I almost sniffed it up my nose, Lord. <laughs> but um, it's kind of very, it's hard to describe the scent, but it smells so good. And I'm, I want to get better with describing scents. But this one, just I've never had this one before. Um, it was new, and I just wanted to get something different because a lot of times when I go to Lush, I get some of the same bath bombs, which one of them I'm going to show you all in just a second. That I, Actually, it's the next one I'm showing you, the one that I always get. It's my tried and true. It's my OG. I love it. But this one, it smells so good. It's almost like a perfumey floral scent. I just, I just can't wait to use it. It smells so good. The next one I got, which is my OG bath bomb that I always want to go to Lush. Anytime I make a look one online or I go in, I have to get this bath bomb. If you've never tried it, if you don't go to Lush and get anything else, get this bath bomb. This is the um, sex bomb from Lush. It is the ish like it is the best bath bomb i'm not gonna say it's the best bath bomb they have but it's the best one that i've tried i feel like it makes your skin so silky so smooth it smells great it just makes you feel so luxurious and sexy and i just i need one of these in my life at least once a month like it's that serious so um this one um actually it's like i think it's like ranges for like seven dollars a little more than seven dollars um which is around the range of most of their bath bombs are usually between five and seven or eight dollars this one smells kind of floral as well but it does smell really different than the last one i showed you all um and it actually has like a real flower in the middle so when you submerge you under the water when you're taking your bath um the flower actually comes out and it has like softening ingredients and i just feel like this bath bomb just gets your skin so soft and silky smooth so ladies if you're having a day night if you're hanging out with your man or whatever this is the one to bathe with before you see him because he's gonna be like your skin is so soft i love it so i got two more and put those back in that gold one put like gold stuff on my leg let's see Ooh. okay dusty Okay, the other two bath bombs I got, this one, I can't remember the name of it. Like I said, I'm gonna link, try to find them online and link them below. Um, but this one is like a little bear. I think it said it was called Coco, Coco Bear or something. And it smells like, oh my God, oh, it smells so good. It's like, a, it's like cocoa butter with a hint of, I don't even know. It's ho it's so hard to describe their scents because they are so unique. I've never smelled anything like Luscious products. Like they need to make these into these bath bombs into Lord. See, I'm getting dust all on my face. They need to make these bath bombs into um, perfume scents because that's how good they are. Um, but yeah. It's supposed to be like very hydrating for your skin. And I love anything that's hydrating, whether it's a lotion or a bath product. Like if it says it hydrates, I'm I'm here for it. Especially now that we're falling into the winter months, even though today's weather did not seem like it. <laughs> um, you definitely want to lean towards things that say they're more moisturizing for your skin because the cold can dry your skin out. So that is so cute, smells so good. And then the last bath bomb, that one right here, it also smells so good. It smells fruity. I think it was called berry something. Um, but it smells like fruity berries, fruity pebbles, juicy fruits and juice. Girl, you use this, you're going to be smelling juicy for your man, for yourself. You're just going to be feeling juicy. So, I love this one as well. They all smell so different, but so good. I just can't go wrong with a good Lush purchase. 
And the last thing that I got from Lush um, is this um, lotion called the Yognog Body Milk. Y'all, this smells like eggnog and caramel and just deliciousness. And if you know me, and if you don't know me, you're going to get to know me. I am a lotion freak. Like, I love lotion. I love body butters. I love moisturizing products. Like, a good lotion is just, I will spend good money on a good lotion like because i believe taking care of your skin is vital like especially us ladies like girl you got to take care of your skin because right now we're young and we're the elasticity is still in your skin whether it be your body or your face but as time goes on that will change as you get older so you want to make sure you take care of your skin now and not be trying to fix it later once it's too late but anywho so the yog nog uh lotion i actually used it on my hands when we left because lush makes you wash your hands before you when you go in before you can touch anything so my hands were a little ashy when we came out of there and it's the perfect opportunity to use it but it smells like eggnog and i personally i'm lactose intolerant so i don't drink eggnog but that holiday milky like caramely like ugh, that scent this is what that is it's so good i love it um, like I said, I'm going to try to find it, see if it's on their website and link it down below. I would assume since the scent sounds like something winter, fall, winter-ish, that this is like a um, limited edition or um, uh, yeah, like some type of limited edition um, holiday collection type of situation. But uh, yes. I love it. I'm going to let you all know how it works like on the rest of my body. Um, and yes, I just love it. So that is everything that I got when we were at the mall today. I always love to treat myself to buy myself things that are nice, smell good. Um, y'all will notice on this channel that um, I just love body products. Now, I do love like makeup and things like that, but I do feel, feel like I spend a lot more of my money on body products, perfumes, lotions, and a lot of more like skincare type things, um, more so than makeup. But yes, like I love me a good body product. So yeah, um, check the description box. Everything that I can find, I will link down below for you all. Um, and if I can't, um, sorry, but yes, just check out um, Lush right now. I think most of the stores have the same things. And then um, the Daisy perfume, that's pretty self-explanatory. You should be able to find it online, but I can link that one as well y'all if you love a good feminine fresh scent you will not regret buying that scent i'm in love but yeah that's everything so um also i said earlier we went grocery shopping so i'm gonna put the groceries up probably start on dinner and um charles he left he had to go do something with his car so when he gets back we'll probably just relax chill eat some dinner um and just enjoy the rest of our sunday and the rest of our nine month anniversary all right all right y'all we just got done eating from the end this vlog for the day hope y'all enjoyed the video go subscribe like everything follow our page it's what instagram mm -hmm. the fab life of aj cp tatty underscore one